Okay, so you're going to want to start with putting it in here. And you move this in the, or open it and close it by rotating the top part and not the bottom part. So you're going to want to make it sure it's nice and snug but not too tight to uh, damage your clay. And this is a kickstart. Kickstart. <laughs> And then you're going to want to start with getting this top little blemish off with one of the larger clay tools. So once that's off, you're left with more bullish finish. And then what I do to make a foot is you get a start and go on again. And then you take this tool and you push down with it and try to make a neat circle. Like that. And then you take one of these and dig out the inside using the circle to guide you. You're not going to make it too deep because you don't want to go through the clay, the bottom of it. Do you enjoy it or are you just like, shut up? I enjoyed dinner and. Alright. That doesn't look too bad now. And so now you're going to want to make the outer part of the foot. She kickstarted it again. And you go about. I don't know. A quarter of an inch outside of the first circle. And do the same thing like the inside. Just push in. And take the same tool. And do what you did on the inside, but in the opposite direction. Now you can play with the depth if you want a larger foot or a smaller foot <laughs> on the inside or the outside. Just as long as the foot, the bottom part of the foot is the only thing touching and the middle part isn't. Alright, and then you're going to want to smooth it out to make it more full yeah, shaped and round. Does anybody need any clay? Not the teacher. Yes, please. Oh my god, we're going to like get all the other attacks on you. No, we're not. She like took away like five things out of your reach. So now you have the beginnings of a foot. Now it just needs to be refined with uh, sharper tools and more precise.